All right, everybody, welcome back to the Morpha project. Um, so today we're gonna be working on the wood part, and then hopefully, you know, once we're done with the wood part, we can then add some uh, stuff of uh, things right here, so that you know everything works fine. But uh, yeah, we're gonna be adding editing the part where you know we're gonna put some wood in there, so that you know things work fine. Uh, I only hope that it is looking decent. I was hoping, by the way, that uh, one of my that my shipment would have come today, but uh, apparently they, they couldn't manage it, so I need to pick it up tomorrow at three o'clock. But uh, yeah, uh, let's continue then, shall we? So yeah, today we're going to be working on this part right here, this thing, and we need to connect that to this lovely piece of artwork right here that. The, uh, the leaves so uh, no further ado let's get started um, I definitely need to put this down into a small version yes there you go all right um, so yeah uh, I have been doing a lot lately I think I found a solution to my stomach problem so that's a good thing because I was really 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 tired of that Alright, now the question is, I should definitely put this in here so that, you know, nothing is actually wrong. Um, yes, but I need to remove this then. And I now need to put this over this. Yes, there you go. Now I can see. So, if we want this to be a real thing, um, we're gonna just, we're just gonna take a look, alright? Just gonna take a look. We're gonna pick up the big, big brush so we can see how we want to do this. We want this to be like this, right? Yeah, and then we need to remove some of it, so we could just pull, pull it like that, and that would fix most of it. Yeah, most of it. So if we then add this to it. All of that would fix it. Yes and no. So this needs to be separately blurred then. Alright. Good to know, good to know, good to know. Um, I want this to be around here to be drawn and here to be drawn. So around that place. And then that's the goal. So we will then add the color to it that we want, which is most likely the brown, but we're gonna put for black because of how black works here. Yeah, it's quite easy to understand. So if we add now the color to it, we should be able to get the point where we, I want to be. So if we now add the brown to it and then put this into an aspect where I can just put brown in, nothing wrong is gonna happen here. No need to be worrying just yet. It's just me figuring out like what to do and how to do it. All right, so this works like that. So if I want this to be in here, I should definitely then move this even one step upwards. Yes, like that. All right, so we need this right there and then we need that right there. And then we need actually a copy of the uh, drawing and then paste it above it with a copy of the coloring as well. Oh, that's gonna be so much work. But it's gonna be worth it. Don't you worry about it. I got this. Even though I don't got this, I got this. This is my specialty. Totally absolute trying to guess what I need to do because this is the first time I ever gonna do it but for every first time it's always a good time so yeah we're gonna work on this bad boy and why are we working on this because well we need to so first thing first we need to actually add this right here and why is this not working 
because I put that on. All right. Um, so we want this right here. And then we want this right here. Uh, well, I want me to just double check where I want this to be. Yeah, we want this to be like that. This doesn't look natural. That looks so much more natural. All right, then we need to move this a little bit down and now we need to move this so that it does fit it. Um, we want it to be like so. Yes, we don't want it like here. We don't, we want it here. Yes, all right. So if we then move this also there, that would fix it. That's the question. If I do this and then I maybe be able to do this the other way around. Hold on. I'm gonna put the hit hap hap wait, alright, there you go. I might be able to do this easier. If I move them behind this Yes. And put these things uh, put these things into a group as well. And then move this around. Like so. Alright, if I move that there, so if I want that to be there, alright, I want that to be there, then I need to um, move this one instead. So I want this to be there, and then that should work like that. Now we have that, and that would work. Right? Yes, that will work. Save it and add that to it. Uh, yes, no, what happened? Don't tell me I moved everything, right? Because I moved this, it doesn't mean I moved the rest of it as well, right? Hmm, hold on. Because I moved this, does that mean that Oh, no, 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 Hmm. I see now. All right. I made a tiny little mistake. We're going to do this again, but this time I'm going to be fixing it. Damn you. I didn't expect the blur tool to be not also being not be able to move. All right, now we fixed. Uh, not that yet. There you go. We need to get this into one layer and then this also in one layer. So. Group. This is gonna be also in that group. This is also going to be in that group. This is also going to be in that group. And this is going to be in that group. 
Now I can move the whole emptying. All right. But we don't want to move that. We actually want to move this instead. So we're going to do that. There you go. Much natural. Much more natural. All right. No need to worry then about that. We can then shut this down because we don't need that anymore. That makes it a lot more cleaner. And now we actually need to work on this. So we're going to put a new layer down, lower this down, and I'm going to redraw. But this time we're going to draw it nicely. Therefore, I don't need this tool. I actually need the pencil tool instead. This one. And 3.6. There you go. All right. So yeah, Should shut this down for now. So yeah, today we're going to be working on the wood again. Uh, this one is going to be a little bit trickier than before because we actually need to. Uh, how do you say that? We need to do some blurring, non-blurring, blurring. So we need to put like give the idea of like close by too far away affect the shot so we need to do a lot of uh, erasing blurring and then nulling erasing so this one is going to be putting me self on the test of you know getting good at it all right so i'm gonna get that right there again All right, that will fix it. And now we need to do the starting process of getting stuff done. So, That's a good sketch. I should definitely follow that up because this thing is actually quite big. start with this part right here and the idea here is that we're literally trying to get the point across I hope though that you know this is all gonna be ending up well well, I don't always have high hopes on this because it's actually very hard to do this one. A, because I have not done it for quite a while. 
be because it's a it's a very hard thing to do anyway. This whole wood effect. And my hand is probably going to be very pain, painly sore afterwards, so just keep on remembering that you need to keep time to break uh, breaks because of how this all works. Because it's actually a very nasty bit of work. It's a high amount of detail, uh, lots of texturing and then following it up by other things around it. I mean this tiny little tablet is quite fine but mm. it has been a cold day by the way. I went outside, did my daily walk and uh, I realized that it was raining again so yeah. And luckily I didn't got too soaked. It uh, it was just a, mi a minor soaking up. But the good thing is that uh, I'm trying to do my very best on keeping everything flowing. But yeah, I figured out that uh, my stomach had a problem and I... Oh, well, I already knew that my stomach had a problem and uh, I think I found a solution to it. The solution is exercise and a lot of more things that would say like increase bacteria and you would like say like wait wait what so yeah increased bacteria is going to be one of the solutions i have a feeling that my stomach is not uh, up to snuff when it comes to bacteria so i hope that will reenact the uh, nerve system in the intestines and uh, yeah casual yogurt Yogurt bacteria, very healthy for you. Although many people won't understand that. Hmm. we have that we can now actually put this back on and we can see where what and who makes mistakes this one can go away now and this one needs to be increased And now I can now finally get the point from point A to point B. So we need to get the color, the right color here done. This one here is the best one to go for. All right. Oh, I see what I did wrong. Ooh, I did something wrong. Oh no. Well, luckily for me, I have a solution for that. That is awful brushing. <coughs> yeah. 
this alpha version will actually work in the way of how I want to, to have it worked anyway. It fixes all the problems. Well, it it creates it will fix the problems that I had now that we have now and then you know create new ones, but that's not the point. The point is that we now have the problem fixed. We have the lines and now we can now get to the part where we need to be, which is these lines right here. And we can just casually like that. Get those lines in line. Of course, we have not yet implemented the uh, shading, but eh, this already gives a good picture anyway. We're just following the lines that we have created and then you know following it up by the rest of it so just like that we follow this up there you go um i need to just double check one whole thing because i have a feeling that my mic is not up to snuff but just in case, you know, you're gonna probably hear me double two, uh, two times, so we have created and then... Ah, it's good. It's good. 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 Fine. Fine. It's all up and dandy. It's all up and handy dandy, so no worry now. I thought it was a little bit too quiet, but no. It's actually quite good. Uh, well, that is the case. Um, it should have been a little bit more better. But tomorrow I will get a new mic, so therefore, you know, I will have a far more clearer voice. And less of a voice that is like... I hope that is... Uh, well, that's at least the idea. So I no longer be talking inside of my... Uh, inside of my nose, instead of uh, talking like open-minded. 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 There you go. Minded. So, yeah. Um, I hope that's going to be happening. Um, I hope the, the whole ending will work. But, uh, yeah. Right. And we can just implement that right now. Implement that. Implement that. Also, I tested out some new software that I bought, but no, I didn't like it. I didn't like the drawing software. So I refunded it because of how the UI and all the stuff works. So it's not like this very easy to understandable. Like you have all the stuff right here. You have all the, br the brush. Uh, you have all the tools right here. You have there. You have the coloring. There the layers and editing. And the brushes right there. But in the, uh, in the, in the drawing, in the software I actually bought was like, no, you don't have that. You have these brushes and you can edit them. But... Uh, yeah, um, good luck finding out what what does. So you didn't have a lot of, uh, you didn't have a lot of things. So it was most likely designed for, um, uh, I believe it was most likely designed to do this. Oh, hold on. I will just draw here. So it was more likely designed to be doing this instead. So if you have like that. And then you have like this and that, and then you can add some blue color towards it. Um, yeah, it was it was more designed to give uh, give the feeling of the uh, it it was not fully designed for what I would like to have it to do, like multiple purposes. Now it was more designed for one whole purpose, and that was actually. Uh, Painting, draw, painting, or how you call it. It, it. The way how normal artists work, you know, just paint stuff. Paint stuff, like painting the whole damn thing. And of course, you know, when you look at me, I'm like, not absolutely not valid in painting. If you ever saw my paintings, oh, Jesus Louise. 
you never want to see them again because they are horribly looking paintings. They are most likely one of those things that you would see in a flea market being sold for like one dollar each. I suck at painting. Why do I suck at painting? Well, because I suck at coloring and therefore, you know, I suck at painting. I don't have that luxury of, you know, being cool and fancy with all the tools I have and all the motion brushes and pr smooth brush strikes. The only thing I know is doing this. Just casually looking at something and then, you know, adding more color towards it. So by doing the brush strikes. So th this, is, this is the maximum I can get. Most of the drawings that I do are literally just drawings. They are not paintings or whatsoever because they don't look like it and they don't act like it. And I wish not to have one of those. I think, you know, paint, uh, paint, paint style looking like drawings, they're nice and such, but they're not my style. <laughs> I rather prefer to just go old fancy pencil mode. I don't know. It has something, all right. It has something like you know you can draw you can draw uh, draw droids or something like that. That's all. That's all what you can do with pencils. You cannot do that with a painting tool. You know you cannot draw that. It's gonna be then more like this, oh fancy, and then be like oh yes fancy mode, and then you have like a big headed boy with a gun. It's not. Uh, it's not my way. It's not the way I wanted it to be. If I wanted to be that way, I would have said so myself, and I don't. So therefore, I don't know. Yeah, jeez Louise. But yeah, um, I actually went outside yes uh, today, and that was actually very good. Because I could not do that yesterday because of all the rain, and the day before that because of all the rain, and also because I had to work. But actually, I already did going outside by just skipping the bus and just walk to the train station instead. But that's different. That's different. That's a whole lot of different. All right. Now we have that. Now we have that tree. Now everybody knows about this tree. All right. This is an ugly piece of shit tree that needs to be some. Needs to have some fixing in it. So we're gonna pick up the darker color. We're gonna pick up this color tool brush, and we're gonna add some stuff here. We're gonna add some stuff here that makes it. Oh, uh oh, 25, 25, there you go, 25, because otherwise we're going to be screwing up a lot of things here. Oh, that's bad. Why is this so annoying? I didn't want to change that into, you know, just general brush boy. Uh, come on. I need to go darker then, because otherwise I will get general brush bro. We don't want general brush. Alright, hold on. Is this the way not to do Oh, this is the instant brush. No, that's that's why it's wrong. Alright, we don't want instant brush. We want non instant brush. We're gonna go non instant brush. Then we're gonna go to seventy five. And then that should fix it. I believe it does. Yes, 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 yes. All right, now, now we keep the, now we keep the coloring. Now we keep the coloring that we want. It's not the finest move, but eh, it will do. All right. Now we have this on, and then brrr, that happens. All right. Brrr. Why are you not consisting in the other one? We want you also in the other one. Or do we need to put it into an exactly same thing? All right, fine. I'll put this then. Uh, can I move this to upper there? And then, yes, there you go. All right. Now we need to do the hard part. Now we need to do the hard thing. First things first, we have a brush, yes. We need to make sure that this is exactly how this works. So we need to make sure that this capacity is a little bit lower than before because otherwise, you know, the tool won't work properly. 
And now we need to do a brushing. So we need to do some brushing, but we don't want to brush it all the way. We just want to remove the sides can be here you can have some sides, alright. This this is still good. This is this needs to be clear. This needs to be clear as day. Not all of it, but it needs to be clear enough. And then it needs to go that way, yes. Yes, that actually works well. Nice. Is it too little bra is it too little blood? No, hold on. You can see. No, it's not really too little blurred. I like it. It's a good amount of blur. So now if we can look at this... Hmm... Hmm... Stupid tree. I'm not good at trees. Nope, I'm not. I suck at this. Uh, well, no, no, no need to worry here. We need to get this thing repositioned on, right? Let's see. This thing needs to be repositioned. Why does it need to be repositioned? Uh, let's see. I'm just gonna do something here. No. And if we now change this up to right that way. That actually would work, right? No, because this is actually like so. I'm gonna fix this later on because right now we don't have the full picture of all these trees, so therefore, you know, things look odd. Her oh boy. Um hmm. Things look super duper odd. Even if I move this to the foreground then things would not work. Ugh. Let's just Let's just pretend that this all is, you know, this is how these trees work. They just create plums. Yeah. Yeah, Let, let's just pretend they only create plums. Plums of gra uh, pl plums of leaves. Because I have clearly no idea how to do this just yet. I will look at it and see how it works. I will make some research. But right now, we're going to leave it right there, because otherwise I'm going to be screwing around for a long time 
with no result, and we want some results. We actually do. It's uh, one of those things that you need to do anyway. All right. So I want to have, what do I want? I want some more grass drawings. Why? Because we actually need to make this whole damn thing up and running. So we're going to do this. We're going to make this tree up and running, and then, then we're going to follow it up with, with some more. Yeah, that's actually quite a good idea. So, uh, we need to put this into a map, and then quick group it, and then put another map. Uh oh. Uh oh. And then that is it. Yes, alright. So, um, we have now our first thing that we need to do is we need to fix this boy. Get this up and running, that one up and running, that one up and running, and that one up and running, and that one up and running, I believe. No, no, no. Only this one. This whole bit we need to fill up. So we need to fill up the tree. Hmm. Yes, we need to fill up the tree. And we need to fill it up in such a way that it works. Alright. That's gonna be a hard one to do, right? This one actually needs to be done in one hand, in one single move. I'm gonna do an experiment. Fuck it. I'm gonna do an experiment. Cheese Louise, I'm gonna be screaming myself over so hard, it's gonna be nothing even funny anymore. So what I'm gonna be doing is quite easily the most hardest thing I ever did. So we're gonna draw this line. Come on. Draw this line in black. Alright. Then we need to actually get this up and running. Oh boy. I'm gonna shoot myself so hard in the back. In the, in the, in the back. Places. I need to sketch this out. Mm. This one, this one, and this one, then I believe? No. This one. This one, yes, there you go. Now I can see stuff. Alright. Yeah, that's actually the way I want to do it anyway. Uh, these are going to be looking like Pokemon trees almost. Jeez Louise. It does have its own charm, but still though. <laughs> it's going to look pretty damn weird, but if there are a lot of them, then it looks no longer weird, so we just have to continue. Even though, you know, it might look a little bit weird at the moment, but once we have the full drawing of it, once we have the full amount of it, we can then still rearrange or redesign some of them. Ah, Pokemon trees, let's go. Just trees that look like cherries on top. Yeah, baby. I must say though, I'm quite impressed upon how much stuff I actually already achieved right now. We already achieved the Malfog, we already achieved the foreground, and now we're actually working on the background and a little bit of the foreground. So, eh, almost. 
And we're already 40 minutes in. Jeez, Louise. All right, all right, all right. Jeez. 40 minutes. All right. I didn't know that I had to, that I uh, that I was already doing that too much. I went. I I looked away for like 40 minutes and then realized it was 40 minutes already in. That means I actually did a lot because I was concentrating so much that uh, you know my whole talking bit was a little bit out of date. Oh well. Hopefully tomorrow the talking will be a little bit more cleaner, more better than before. And I will be able to do this more properly. Let's do it. So yeah, um, these trees, not the best trees, not the end of the world though, trees, but they're trees. I regard them as trees, you can see they are trees and they might look a little bit odd. But if we make the whole environment a little bit odd, then it will work quite properly well. Yeah, it will work, it will work, it will work. It will, regardless. Because I can just do this, and then do this. Like that. Alright, we have now achieved one whole tree part. Woohoo! It's a big giant stumpy boy. And then we can look at this, and we can see like, yeah. But we also have these kind of strange things in the, in the background, so yeah, probably just gonna be working with these very weird trees for a long time. Now we also need some weird kind of mid-sections of this. So where do I want them? I want right here one and here one, like that. And then I'm gonna be adding that as well too the part I have. Of course these parts are in the background so therefore you know we should definitely reduce the amount of detail in these trees because otherwise things might look a little bit weird. And we don't want to have a too much attention breaking. Um, this needs to be a little bit reduced. Like to that, that size, right? Oh, I didn't pull on the full er eraser button. All right. Well, fine. There you go. So. Now I can add that part that I want. Like so. Alright. Whew. Uh, what part do I want to go first for? I think I will go first for the tree part and then go for the other part, right? Yes, I would. Uh, cancel this one because we don't need that anymore. We can erase that from existence and we can now get that part up and running. All right, um, 43 minutes. Yeah. All right, so yeah. It has been quite a while. Uh, yesterday I was busy. Uh, I had some bad news to. Uh, 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 how do you say that? Talk, uh, think about. And um, eh, I hope that the bad news is not going to be staying forever, but you know, we can still keep our hopes up. The doggo had, uh, had a little bit of a problem with his back, so therefore it was a little bit of a sad day to see him being very uh, off, you know. Normally the, the guy is always so enthusiastic and very happy and now he's like sad and moody. That was a little bit sad to see. So yeah, I um, I kind of, uh, I kind of was like, a, like, nah, I'm not in the mood of drawing today because, well, you know, I still feel remorse and uh, that was a sad thing to see. So uh, yeah, I uh, I had to wait for a bit, fix a lot of things. I uh, I worked also on the on the writing a bit, fix a thing, fix on the things, and then I came to the realization that there were another there was another snake on it. I realized that there was another snake. Who would have thought there was another snake? Um, so what happened? I'll I'll tell you this because it's quite easy to understand. Um. 
you have two tenses that you can t type in. You can go for past or you can go for present. And then I went for past and present. Not in the same sentence, not in the same chapter. I went in the same... I went in the... I had like past tense in the one chapter and then uh, present tense in the other chapter. So... Yeah, I needed to fix that. Well, I need to fix that quite fast. Although, it doesn't really matter too much, if I'm honest, because of how the story goes. It was done in the past, so therefore it should be... Set it should be uh, it should be spelled in the past, but I, I have no idea. It, I I still need to fix that, and uh, it's gonna probably take a lot of time from me again to fix that part. And I was so close to fixing it. Oh my god! Ugh! Yikes! It's that, or I can fix the other part and put that all into the present. But eh. I put it already in the present, and then I need to put it back in the past. No, that's not going to be happening too much, to my, in my opinion. So yeah. Um, I hope everybody is already having a great day today, because, you know, it's, a, it's quite cold here. Lots of rain, lots of rainy rain that is actually one of those things that is quite common here. It's a froggy country. But, uh, yeah, I'm very happy how far everything else is going. The drawing's getting all smoothed up. The auto drawing that needs to be done in February is also getting better. Uh, equipment is going to arrive tomorrow, so, uh, yeah, things are looking up pretty much. And I'm happy upon that. You know, I have been busy all, the day, uh, all these days and uh, I'm doing quite well already. Now, um, let's see. This is the tree pond, and you need to. That's where the sneaky stuff comes in. If this thing pops up, and now uh, you totally ruin things. This is why you always need to keep on your guard. You cannot just do everything quick, otherwise things can go bad. I know, right? It's it's quite crazy when you think about it. Like, ah, well. You can just do your drawing, it's not very hard to just do your drawing, and then it's like, but this thing right here can put me off guard, and then everything goes to smithereens. Dear God. It's like having a virus inside of your PC, and you need to fix the whole damn PC to fix the virus. No, I had to do that once. I had to load up and reboot everything. Ugh. It was the only way to get rid of the virus, and then I finally, then I was like, alright, fine. Fine, fine, I will buy myself an antivirus instead. <sighs> because I was sick and tired. Well, I should not have been pirating then instead. But, uh, you know, everything is blamed on me, which is true. You know, you can blame it on me for pirating, but still, though. Complaining that you have a virus is also a thing that, eh, sometimes has happened. Even if you just uh, uh, visit some sites, you can still have some... Nasty little cookies that you cannot remove. Ugh. Those are the worst. Nasty cookies. Not like the sweet cookies that are like, you know, not taking up any space, but the nasty cookies. Eh, they are horrible. Some of them even wear Trojan viruses with them. Nasty boys. Oh well. You know, that's where, that, this is where, you know, I always like to be like, Oh yeah? You can ruin my PC? No, I will be the one who ruins my PC and then, you know, I just delete everything and just start over again. I did that probably already 10 times in 10 years, so, you know. It's quite, it's a quite common thing and that this is why I always have saved everything up in diff on, uh, on special drive so that I don't get lost so even this thing is like saved in an external hard drive so that if my PC does uh, kaboom then uh, well this thing gets saved and uh, I don't need to worry about it and what I need to worry about now is actually that I need to make sure that I do the move uh, the move is actually that I need to uh, how do you say uh, remove some of the layers 
so I need to merge them, but if I do that right now, things will get ruined, uh, things might get ruined, so we still need to keep up with the 6.8 gig. But once I merge them, it will probably go back to 4.5 gig or something like that, and then everything is all fine again. But yeah, I need to make sure that I don't ruin the part because, as I said before, this might need some editing. So therefore, well, not this live stream, but the drawing itself needs some editing after I'm done with the whole damn tree, after I'm done with all the trees. So probably it will be at 10 gig and then I need to reduce it to 5 then afterwards. Yeah, probably. And then I can finally add, and then I can make it into a full background. Anyway, uh, I think that's all for now. I hope you all have enjoyed. And uh, thanks all for watching. And I hope I'll see you all next time. Until then, I wish you a lovely day. And uh, bye!